How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. The following scary images are leaving people on edge. But as always, before we dive in, remember to hit that subscribe button for more creepy content. Just like this. There are certain locations that seem to attract spirits like magnets. Typically these spots have tragic histories steeped in suffering and death. When YouTuber ZTube Family visited the town of Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, they captured some compelling photos and videos of what is sometimes called the most haunted town in America. The owner of the channel, Melissa Z, shared this haunting evidence with us. Gettysburg was the site of one of the bloodiest battles of the American Civil War. Over the course of three days in 1863, approximately 10,000 people lost their lives and 30,000 more were injured. With so many casualties, it's unsurprising that visitors to Gettysburg frequently report spotting ghosts around the battlefield. The hauntings don't end there, however. Injured soldiers were housed in buildings all around the city, and it's thought that the spirits of some of these unfortunate men linger in the places where they spent their final hours. Some think the spirits are peaceful, while others retain auras of anger and pain left over from their experiences in the war. Gettysburg truly is a town of the dead. The family that captured these photos visited Gettysburg in May of 2021. During their stay, the family visited a haunted location each night in hopes of capturing ghostly images. They weren't disappointed. On one evening, they hunted for spirits near Little Round Top, the site of one of the most famous skirmishes during the Battle of Gettysburg. This skirmish accounted for over 1,500 of the battle's total casualties. The family took numerous photos around the site. They later discovered something rather chilling in one of the photos. A mysterious black mass can be seen blocking the pathway in front of them. It almost blends into the surrounding darkness, but close inspection shows that there's definitely a dark shadow in the shape of a slightly rounded triangle standing out against the night sky. The mass is even more visible in an equalised version of the photo. A noise analysis of the photo seems to indicate that it hasn't been altered in any way either. Some paranormal experts believe that some spirits are unable to appear in corporeal form, as it requires a high amount of energy. They believe it's more common for spirits to appear as shadows or balls of light. Often, these indications of a ghostly presence can't be seen with the naked eye, but show up clearly in photos and videos. So could this creepy black mass indicate the presence of one of the many victims of the Battle of Gettysburg? You never know what will happen during a night out on the town. Redditor Swedish Blueberry certainly didn't expect to come home with this eerie photo while sharing some drinks with a friend at a local park late one night. While the Redditor and her friend were having a good time in the park, they decided to snap a selfie. However, it seems as if the park wasn't quite as empty as they originally thought. When they looked at the photo later, they noticed a figure in the background that they're sure wasn't there when they took the photo. There appears to be a woman with pale skin walking down the path behind them. Some viewers think that she's probably just an ordinary woman that the girls didn't notice. However, one would think you would remember a strange pale lady walking through a park late at night. Although the Redditor admits to being under the influence of alcohol when they took the photo, this sight would be hard to miss. So what's actually going on in this photo? Does it show a perfectly ordinary woman that the Redditor and her friend failed to notice? Or were they being followed by someone or something? Look at the photo closely and judge for yourself. Cemeteries are a common spot for ghost hunters to try their luck at capturing evidence of ghostly activity. Sydney Southwest Paranormal Investigators believe they hit the jackpot when they visited St Bartholomew Cemetery. St Bartholomew Cemetery in Sydney, Australia is said to be haunted by numerous spirits. 
A few of the graves date back to 1841, with some even containing Sydney's first colonists. Stories say that John Pond, the former gravedigger and warden of the cemetery, still lingers there long after his death. Pond's spirit is said to be relatively friendly, unlike the ghost of Benjamin Holland, a former sea captain who is also buried in the cemetery. Holland's grave is the site of the majority of paranormal events in the cemetery, and not all of them are pleasant. Holland apparently takes great offence to anyone laughing near his grave, causing those who offend him to feel sick or momentarily paralysed. Some people even claim they've lost consciousness at the gravesite. Others say that Holland's ghost sometimes appears walking around the graveyard, distinguished by his unusual gait. However, it's another spirit who caught the public's attention when this bizarre photograph was published by the group Sydney Southwest Paranormal Investigators. In the image, we see a translucent white figure standing near a headstone. The figure has a clear human shape, but is completely devoid of features. A local historian who feels a strong aversion to visiting the area of the cemetery where this photo was taken, believes this could be the ghost of Thomas James Willis, whose young daughter, Emily, is buried there. Emily died at the age of three, and she and her father seem to be confined to the cemetery in the afterlife. According to the historian, Emily is a spirit that loves to play tricks on visitors, often darting towards the nearby highway to make visitors think that a child's in danger. So could this photo show the spirit of Willis looking for his missing daughter, Emily? Or perhaps it's the spirit of the surly sea captain, Benjamin Holland, or even gravedigger, John Pond. With so many reported hauntings and first-hand accounts of paranormal happenings, it seems this mysterious figure could indeed be a sign of the afterlife. When Slapham viewer Gordon M snapped a photo to commemorate a fun night at a concert, he never expected to end up with a ghostly photo. However, it seems spirits have a way of surprising you. The photo was taken in May of 2017 when Gordon and his family were headed to see Iron Maiden playing concert. They found an out of the way spot to capture the photo where the rest of the crowd wouldn't be in the background. Nothing about the spot seemed unusual. However, when they looked at the photo later, they noticed something rather strange, an unexplained person standing behind them. The figure appears to be a man wearing a red jacket. He's looking down towards the ground. However, Gordon and his son are absolutely certain that there was no one behind them when they took the photo. The figure is clearly very close to them, so it would have been difficult for him to sneak up behind them without them noticing. Even at the outdoor venue, they surely would have heard footsteps approaching from behind. So does this image show a photobombing concert goer or something far more sinister? Love to get your thoughts in the comments down below. When the Retford Ghost Hunters visited the Sheffield General Cemetery in the UK, they walked away with compelling evidence of the cemetery's status as a haunted location. The Sheffield General Cemetery has been in existence since 1836, established during the country's Victorian era. The graveyard is filled with granite monuments and sculptures that lend an eerie air to the allegedly haunted location. When the ghost hunters visited, they took numerous photos so that they could examine them later for indications of spiritual activity. They weren't expecting to see something quite so compelling. In one of the photos, a white ghostly figure stands out starkly against the night sky. The figure appears to be a woman in a flowing white dress hovering just above a grave. The woman in white is a common ghostly manifestation typically believed to be the spirit of a woman who died amidst tragedy or heartbreak. This particular woman in white is believed to be the spirit of Catherine Parker, a merchant's wife who died by suicide in 1844. Her husband died without a will, leaving Catherine and her five children destitute. After years of struggling to care for them alone, the stress and anxiety became too much for Catherine. She hanged herself and became one of the first to be buried in the Sheffield General Cemetery. 
Numerous visitors to the cemetery claim to have spotted a ghostly figure garbed in a white dress floating about the gravestones late at night. Catherine's life was certainly filled with heartache, making her a likely suspect for the mysterious woman in white. So could this photo really show Catherine's tormented spirit? Let me know what you think down below. This photo from redditor Beetlemuse seems to show something inexplicable and has caused quite a stir in the paranormal community. The photo was taken during a tour of a museum. Next to an exhibit enclosed in a glass case, we see a young man walking past. Everything about the photo seems relatively normal on first glance. However, if you look closely at his feet, you'll notice something highly unusual. There appears to be three feet instead of two. The black sole of his left shoe is visible in one spot and an entire shoe of a completely different colour can be seen in front of it. So what's going on in this strange photo? Some viewers believe that the shadows on the floor don't match with the image that we see, suggesting that it could be photoshopped. However, others point out that a ghostly appendage may not cast a normal shadow. Another possibility is a photo glitch. Because the man was clearly moving when the photo was taken, it's possible that the camera caught his foot in two different positions, creating the weird effect that we see. However, a close examination of the shoe seems to rule out this possibility. First of all, the ghostly foot is wearing a completely different shoe altogether. Additionally, the position of the mysterious third foot would be impossible based on the man's position. If the camera glitched and captured a previous or subsequent step, the third foot should appear further behind or in front of the man. So what do you think's going on in this strange photo? Until further information comes to hand, it will have to remain a mystery. Before we take a look at an eerie photo taken in an abandoned attic, remember to hit that subscribe button, then tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be in the loop every time we drop our scary and mysterious videos. Also, remember to hit that thumbs up button, otherwise a demonic entity may crawl down your throat while you're sleeping tonight. Abandoned houses such as the residence featured in this photo from Imager user ARG6531 are another great place to hunt for spirits. Sometimes a ghostly apparition might make an appearance even when you aren't expecting it. This photo was taken when the user's friend snuck into an abandoned house in their town to explore. They took numerous photos during their visit, including this photo from the attic. On first glance, there doesn't seem to be anything unusual. There are only a few items scattered around the abandoned attic, nothing to indicate a ghostly presence. However, when the explorer later shared the images with friends, they noticed something they didn't see before. It seems that the explorer wasn't alone in the abandoned house. If you look closely at the small bench on the left hand side of the photo, there seems to be a translucent figure watching them. The figure is almost entirely transparent but seems to be a young boy seated on the bench with his head turned towards the camera. Some viewers believe he has an old fashioned hairstyle and clothing. So who knows how long he could have been residing in this old attic. Is this ghostly boy for real or is the photo a fake? Without more information, it's impossible to determine who this lonely spirit could be. For now, this ghostly presence remains an unsolved mystery. If you want to see some more freaky photos, then check out that link on the top there. Otherwise, this creepy playlist here will keep you entertained for hours and hours. Leave us a comment down below which one of these photos you thought was the weirdest or scariest. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time.